Hi, Year 8s, and welcome to your Term 3 tutorial on aerobic and anaerobic respiration. Respiration is the active and passive process of breathing. There are two forms of respiration that are used during sport, aerobic respiration and anaerobic respiration. Aerobic respiration. This form of respiration is the most common and produces the majority of our energy. This is used when we are at rest or taking part in low intensity exercises for long periods of time, for example, running a marathon or cycling long distance. This form of respiration uses oxygen as its main supply of energy. We also use glucose from carbohydrates and fat supplies, the energy for the aerobic energy system and can supply energy for long periods of time. The equation for aerobic respiration is glucose plus oxygen, energy plus water plus carbon dioxide. The equation shows that the glucose and the oxygen produces the energy we need plus the water or sweat and the carbon dioxide which we breathe out. Anaerobic respiration. This form of respiration is used to supply energy very quickly. This is used when activities only last a few seconds for example, a vault in gymnastics, a 100 meter sprint, or a javelin throw. This system breaks down glucose into lactic acid. Glucose is derived from carbohydrates and it produces energy very quickly. The equation for anaerobic respiration is glucose into energy plus lactic acid. The equation shows that glucose is used to produce energy for us and then lactic acid is produced as a waste product. So that was a very, very short video. Make use of replaying it as many times as you can. Make some notes, test yourself with a friend and feel free to use the link for further knowledge.